Welcome back to Dark Souls. Demon Souls. I'm here. Which one did we go to? Do you want to go to the same place? Uh, yeah. Might as well. Let's just get it over with. Was that this place? What, what place were we just in? You were in the Burrow King. Okay. Dwarf Man in the Mines. Okay, good. Yeah. So you've been here and you've been you've been in one uh, World 1 and World 2, basically. That's way too loud, by the way. That's way too loud. You have not set your TV to the proper audio level for recording. You unprofessional man. I also wasn't ready for this episode to start. <laughs> but here we go. Hi, everyone. I'm the only one at the microphone right now. Andrew's getting up close and personal with you at the Silent Chief. It's just a loading screen. He is admiring his peck armor. No one will notice. Everyone noticed. No one will notice. Everyone noticed because I pointed it out. Why? Because <laughs> I literally never hide unprofessionalism. <laughs> Instead, I did the opposite. You should always hide it. <laughs> it's called Hollywood. Why do you guys keep doing this? I already punished you once. <laughs> Gotta wonder why they do it. Uh, cause there's a fat man that- with a whip. Yeah. Behind them. Oh yeah, that is true. Where are the rocks <laughs> coming from, though? That is a better question. Cause they have to take them up there, to then throw them down. So like, are they putting them on that one elevator to take them up there just to throw them down? <laughs> like, that's their whole process, is to try to destroy the direction you can come from. Could you not do this? They're so spiteful. I don't even know you. Like, This, this who axe are is you? bound to be so useful. It's just so fast. It is very fast, and I like that. Well, hi there, doggy, doggy, you doggy. You be Flaily Axe Man. Don't come near me, please. I'm scared. Wanna, oh, oh uh, probably hey. want to block that attack. I also don't like. Don't want to lock onto this guy. Yeah. Fucking ugh. Ugh. Lock on mechanics. He's so bad. Can I just lock onto the enemies in front of me? I got little tusks. Oh, that one's dead. Where are you going? Where? Where, where are you going? <laughs> there he is. Jesus. These fucking dogs, man. There you go. Oh no. Wh where He's are escaping. you going? He's, He's very confused. He's distractible like Shadow. Some of these fucking enemies, man. It's like, did you... Maybe he just wants to play and he, they don't understand that they have those tusks, like, fastened to their face that, like, garrote you. <laughs> Not programmed it. Ah, what? Wait, what? Yeah. Is he supposed to be here? I thought he was supposed to be behind the wall. Give him a hug. Oh, oh, fire. Yeah, the fire guy. It's fine. Just stay behind the wall and he won't hit you. Hug him. Hello. Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> This guy is such a prick. <laughs> He's genuinely like, just, <laughs> he didn't react to you at all. Oh no, does that mean all the other guys are mad at me though? Uh, just go up. Alright. That, that guy might have the most broken AI I've ever seen in Demon's Souls, to be honest. <laughs> I'm like, I'm not sure what what's going on and what they wanted from him. Oh, God. oh, be very careful. So now when you're hitting one of them, you might get hit by the other one if you're not careful. Come on. Maybe best to have them come around the corner, yeah. Oh no! Oh, wow, I cannot hit that guy. But he has full mobility. <laughs> Maybe the answer to this is you need to use the pickaxe. <laughs> God. And then you have their move set that apparently works so well here. Oh, there goes your stamina. Wow. Yep. What? <laughs> it's back going on you. Is that one down? Nope. This is a really difficult area to fight in. There you go. Now it's one-on-one. -on -one. Never take another hit or else you will have failed me. Come on. Watch that stamina. It's so nice to have a 100% block shield. Uh-oh. Don't want to get staggered. Not today. There you go. You're learning to avoid the attack entirely instead of tanking it. God, get off me. It's like, as opposed to blocking it, you're backing party. off to avoid taking any stamina hit. Alright, there's nothing in these rooms anymore. Because some enemies are so slow, you can abuse that. There's another one, right? Like that ass hole. There might not be. I only remember three being in this hallway. Okay. But maybe you'll prove me wrong. But there's <laughs> a fat guy in here. There's a fat guy. He's going to hit you with fireballs that might kill you. He wishes. But you already opened the gate, right? Yeah. So you could, so you can leave Mr. Fat Guy, unless, unless you want to specifically murder him and see if that's a thing you can do. 
Well, can I even reach him? Yeah. Ow. Not not here, but you can. Well, that guy died. Who? That was close. <laughs> uh, touch bloodstain. Show me what you've got. Oh, there he is. <laughs> he went backwards. Where are you going? What a good plan. Did he fall off? No, I got hit by a fireball. Wow, you, you the best. Well, that was pretty pretty straightforward cause and effect as far as how his death went. Honestly. Congratulations, a new place. A lot of moving parts. Uh, so how do I make shortcut to get back here without having to take that long hike? Uh, that was a short hike. That, um, what? That was yeah. a short hike? Yeah, you just go down the one, the one hallway. No. There's more shortcuts, sure, but not... You haven't gone any further yet. No. The shortcut was that you opened that gate so you didn't have to go around and, and pull the lever again. No. You just you just used the shortcut. I don't like it. You gotta it. progress a little bit more to find more shortcuts. I don't like any of that. No. Should, I feel like we should celebrate. You just got two half moon grass. We should celebrate because fuck! No, fuck! Uh, what there are those guys? And what celebrate! Are those guys? What? What are those guys and those guys? You got two new things to look at here. Wait, there's two new things where? Yeah. Oh, Jesus. Those are some Charmanders. I'm not about that. <laughs> but also, what are they using? What are they using? Are they using bows? Are they using swords? I, from this graphical quality, I cannot tell. Hey, what are you guys, what are you guys using? Do you think healing might be a good idea? Oh, maybe they're using trombones. Hold on. There you go. Is this a band? Can I join your band? Sounds like a cool band. Oh uh -oh. my god, that's a fire sword. Get oh the no. fuck away from me. They've got red hot swords. Oh, that don't, don't fall in there. <laughs> it's time. <laughs> oh no. Oh, wow, whoa, whoa. Oh, whoa, he's he out. Whoa, he's out. He chasing attack. Oh no. No, no, no. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. Let me heal. That was not cool, man. And you might not be able to fully block it. You'd be able to block, the, yeah, it did a little bit of damage, but you're mostly fine. So, Ooh. what's going on there is you have a 100% block, but only for physical. So he's attacking you with elemental damage in addition to that. Not much, but it's there. <gasps> that was scary. <laughs> yeah, that that's, this guy's gotta go. So if you take fire damage, you can't block it. Not okay. entirely. Uh, you're, I don't Not know entirely? Because this room looks entirely made of fire uh, damage. Look at, you're <laughs> safe right now. Let's look at your shield. Uh, physical slash pierce fire. There we go. Yeah. Why? Oh wait, that's a different menu. Why oh, is did you, it? Did you press the yeah. unequip button? Yeah, what click, is it? Triangle. It should always be square. Square feels like it should be. Well, the no, no. Item. So what happens is you click on this. You click on it. Okay. On the, you click on the shield itself right now. Oh. X. Then you press square. Oh. To do the other screens of this. So okay. that symbol. So fire day, fire attack plus zero. Yes. Um. Yeah, it's kind of unhelpful, actually. Uh, so it says damage reduction 100% and 30%. Yeah. So the 100% block means that you have 100% block of physical damage. Okay. But it does not apply to elemental damage. Okay. And unfortunately, I don't th I don't know if Demon Souls actually has accurately like, explains elemental. elemental resistances. Okay. Uh, in uh, in later my... Souls games, you'll have a spreadsheet dedicated to how much of what ele each element you are your shield. Because I have block. bleed, poison, and plague resistance. Fire de to fire defense. So yeah, 58. That's 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 what that's when you get hit though. Yeah. So when I got hit with the fire damage, it was really severe. Yeah. So I don't know what that means. I don't, I, don't, I, don't, I don't know what 58 means. Whatever the 58 is, it's less than your physical resistance, and your That's... physical resistance has never been impressive either. So what you're saying is I'm not strong enough to go down there. Oh no, I would not <laughs> recommend running through the fire. Through the fire uh, and flames, you say? Through the fire and flames. Okay, I'm gonna ask for you to come next. Come on. Come on. Can you throw something at him? Oh, here it comes. So the good news is you can tank their attack by blocking it. It seems to mostly work. But you do take, like, a minor amount of damage because your shield doesn't 100% work in this context. And unfortunately, take, uh, blocking the hit means half your stamina is gone that you'd rather use for the combo. So swings are best avoided by walking away, but this, the charge has to be blocked unless you want to be a Oh, trouble. wow, you try to get me from behind. You yeah, were, you did. You crafty. You crafty. Do you have throw items the, at the moment? You probably have, like, a dagger or something. Uh, it's uh, not, it's not, not super a, applicable it's right not now. I don't need my souls equipped. It's not as applicable right now, but when you're in a situation where you're trying to drag one guy out. I've got Old Spice. 
when you got a crowd of enemies like that, sometimes you can draw one of them out by throwing a knife at them. Uh, turpentine, throwing knife. Yeah. You can use throwing knives or fire bombs. Like anything that you can throw at somebody might be oh. able to, it might be usable for aggroing one specific enemy. Yeah, I don't have fur. Right bombs. now there seems to be one dude though. Yeah. Well I'm not gonna use it now. This yeah. guy's it's just this dumb guy. Come on. Walk all the way back here where it's open space. Yeah. I don't where, you're, where you're absolutely sure no one else will show up. Yeah. Ooh, that is a mighty strike, and that does little no damage. There you go. Oh, is he gonna fall in? Is he gonna? Oh! No, don't take the fire damage. He didn't fall in. <laughs> but it was close. What are you doing? What are you doing? <laughs> no, you gotta hit him. You gotta hit him. What are you doing? Get in there. What are you doing? Yeah. Oh, oh, that was dead. Oh, don't God. fall in. Whoa. You can do it. So, did oh. you notice that you did a successful repost? No. <laughs> yeah. He's, he's, you were spamming parry, and he, what happened? Uh, well, you did a successful parry, I mean. Uh, he was you were spamming parry, and he happened to time his attack perfectly with your parry that it went the dongs like bell oh, sound. Is that why he bounced he, back? That's why he kept swinging. Not the like, specific bounce back, but when his, his hand recalled back and he looked frozen in slow motion for a moment. Oh, that was because you parried him successfully, like you did back in the in the in the tutorial at the oh, beginning. Oh God, please, game. Yeah, physics doesn't work out great sometimes. Oh, Do you, you remember your successful parries from the, from the tutorial, right? Yeah. So you you did that again here, and so if you had done an R one attack at that point, like a backstab, you would have been able to finish him off. Oh. Yeah, that's well, what that's, that's your reward for a successful parry. Okay, so I want to check out the salamander room, but I also don't want to check out the salamander room. Because I don't want to die and have to come <laughs> back here. Because it's going to be a pain in the ass. But what do they do? Oh, there's a lot of them. <laughs> there's a lot of them. There's a lot. Well, you can test your knife. Yeah, I guess I could do that. If, you uh, could, if you're able to lock onto one, then you could test your knife on it without walking in there. Wow. Oh, no. Oh, are you is, is okay? He gonna come after you oh, I'm so no? sorry. I am so sorry. What's he gonna do? Oh, there uh, we go. Uh, okay. That's kind of cute. What are you, uh, what are you doing coming there? straight at you. What are you doing there, little guy? I believe in you. You can do it. Come on. Come on. Uh oh. Ow, oh, oh my oh, god. That oh, is so much damage. Oh no. Ow, no! <laughs> what? He's not even fluid. He's just, he's just liquid. Oh my god! I was gonna fucking smack him right in the face hole, and now I have to fucking run. <laughs> oh. oh god. That was an interesting strategy where you're like, it didn't work the first time. I'll try again. No, I tried fucking getting out of there the second time. But didn't you walk towards him? I know. I tried bouncing backwards, but I was locked onto him. <laughs> oh come on! You can fuck right <laughs> off with that shit. <laughs> I am so over this fucking game. No. Uh, like 90% of. Oh my god. You are close to a shortcut. 90%. Fuck, you should have said that before I went <laughs> to the salamander room. <laughs> no, wait. No, that doesn't matter. If you kill the dogs fast enough, that guy will never catch you. Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Come on, come on, come on! Oh no! Okay, so here's here's the thing. Let's uh <laughs> let's break down what the problem is. You promised people you'll never quit. <laughs> hundred and one percent. I keep finding more places where you promise people you're not gonna quit. Hundred and one percent. Uh, <laughs> this game has by far the worst I've ever experienced to lock on mechanic. <laughs> it it basically is just a ruse to get you to fuck up on purpose. There is no reason to have a lock on mechanic this fucking bad unless you intentionally <laughs> wanted to fuck with people. It is the worst. You're, you're talking about the part where it locks onto the wrong people. It always locks onto the wrong people. Yeah. It never locks onto the right person. I have to manually do it. Yeah. That's not a lock on mechanic. That's a fucking waste of time. Like this guy, this specific fucking guy, I want this guy right here. Who is that? That's not the guy I asked for. <laughs> this fucking guy. Why do I have to get in his face to do it? So they, they definitely learn from their mistakes over time. By not including a lock-on mechanic, good no, good the, learning. The, of course, there's always a lock-on mechanic. You've used it in Dark Souls 2, <laughs> remember? And Dark Souls. It's just fucking. And our very brief forays that didn't go anywhere. Uh. So they, they generally learn to not put large numbers of enemies in the same room like this in, in a lot of games, but also uh, they'll make a lot of characters not 
impossible to be locked on to on purpose until until you make them hostile. Wow, what a what a fucking concept. Yeah. What a concept. <laughs> the guys that aren't going to attack attack me shouldn't be locked onable. Oh yeah. god, do they, they fix you, that? Get your 33 souls back. The full screen. Thing. Yeah. The fucking <laughs> hey, by the way, let me tell you what's going on, but don't worry about the game that doesn't pause. Like, yeah, this game has the most uh God. Terrifying reclaimed souls screen where it covers your entire screen. It's genuinely scary. Okay, well you ain't fooling no nobody. Oh, that, that fireball guy. almost came in. That was scary. Watch out, that guy might come up behind you. How many? How many do you get? You get he, one he was, swing. He was doing a sweet dance. Yeah, well his sweet dance is a fucking goddamn disaster. <laughs> okay, just. Great. You shoved him back. Yeah, he's good. Yeah, here. That's great. That's great. Oh. I don't need companionship. <laughs> he's... God. Watching his body move as he healed was amazing. Oh. oh, now you notice me. Yeah. He's just like. Oh. They're just not all that bright. Good news is you aggroed him far enough away that he might not even have a friend right now. Yeah, that's what I was hoping. So he's the variable that's scary in this scenario, is that there's one guy at a door and one guy at another door, this, and this guy patrols. <laughs> so he's actively a problem for you when you're trying to methodically, carefully plan this out. Because you have to account for a character that moves around. Alright, so where's the other guy? There he is. Nice try there, fuckaroonie. Stay in your fucking Gotta get hole. them sowls back, you leaving? Yeah, fuck that yeah. guy. Yeah, he won't catch you. Yeah. If, you, if you just go upstairs and go through the gate, like, he's, you're so far away at that point. Yeah, that's the point. I was just like, I, as long as I don't pull him in, then I don't have to worry about fighting him later. Just don't get hit by fear, da, ball. Da, 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 da. Ah! You have the high ground, huh? See, it's not a long run. Yeah, because... He just it. died again during it, that's no big deal. Yeah, I only died during and it. lost everything. Like you do. I don't care about the souls. <laughs> the souls fucking mean nothing to me. Yeah. That's the satisfying thing about real progress is that the bosses give you a big old chunk of souls. Yeah, I mean, at the end of the day, having like all those souls I lost would be nice. And you are getting physical but, souls along the way. Yeah, but I can just, I, if I wanted to, I could just farm for souls. And as you get better, you'll stop losing souls constantly. Oh, fuck, I forgot about the fire sword guys. I don't want to fight all of them. <laughs> you figured them out, though. You know how to do it. Fuck you. Yeah. That did a lot of damage, actually. <laughs> yeah, actually. For a throwing weapon. Yeah, I did a pretty good amount of damage. Especially since it probably scales with dexterity or some other stat you don't really have, honestly. Oh, I thought you were going to take that. Oh, no. I thought you were really... Oh, no. Are you trying to parry him? No. Oh. I'm just trying not to get stabbed by him. I wasn't quite sure if I saw the parry animation or not. Who are I'm you? Like, get out of my fucking game. I'm like, that's game. ballsy. It's you from earlier. <laughs> How weird would that be? Fuck you. He's kind of using a similar weapon He's style. He's using a club. He still has his big old baby club. Are you having problems? Do you have a knife sticking out of you? You look so dumb. <laughs> Gotta go get them weapon upgrades if we can. If we can. Bye. Oh, he's super dead now. When he stands up. Are you? Are you good? There we go. Oh no, you're not. You have to stand up to take damage. Oh, that's nice. You usually can't take damage when you're down, even if it doesn't make any sense. Like you're laying in fire. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, flawless. Yeah, as long as you don't get up, just you a can't little, attack. Just a little blocky chip damage. A good little satisfying rubble to destroy and take the frame rate with. There's like a whole tunnel down here. Yeah, well, what about this? Well, which one do you think seems more promising? Uh, menacing fog gate or side area? I guess side area, but these guys are kind of armed. Because they... In the Souls games, they pr and even Bloodborne, they pretty much universally use the Fog Gate to denote the sense of progress. Okay, cool, you guys so aren't- So Fog Gate generally means you're going forward towards the mandatory direction. You guys aren't salty with me. Grass and grass. Alright, what's that? It's- Don't go forward without soul remains. Um... Well, I'm gonna get That these. sounds problematic, what does that mean? Unknown hero soul. Well, I got the soul remains. So what do you want? I guess we'll go forward now. Wait, was that just a reference to the souls that you could pick up? Oh no! That's confusing. Hey, it's a fucking 
Oh wow, thanks Keith. Yeah. Told me to go to the fucking salamander room when there's a goddamn checkpoint. I did not checkpoint. tell you to go to the salamander room. You just really wanted to you check it out. You didn't tell me there's a fucking checkpoint right here. <laughs> I could have avoided all of that. Aren't you happy though? The no, here? not particularly. Just write it. Check it out. It just fucking goes down to the old bags place. Check it out. This is not. Don't no fucking reject my advice after giving me shit for not giving you advice. I will do. Oh, look well, an item. Hey, come on. <laughs> well, now where are you? What the fuck? This place looks shitty. Check that out. Goodbye. Oh, why not? I'm getting that item that was up there. <laughs> this, this place looks shitty. Goodbye. <laughs> that, that item's way more. So you see that? That's the beginning that, area. That is what I want. So there's the there's where you start. So you have this here now. Yeah, now but what was that place down with, below? Now you can proceed with zero pro, uh, zero uh, time lost. You never have to go past Boulder guys again. Thank you. Or those shard guys of, in that hallway. Shard of Clearstone? You've made genuine, irreversible progress, Andrew. No! Oh, no! <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, my God! <laughs> what? Time to use that shortcut. Dude! <laughs> fuck you! <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> that was God. amazing! Are you fucking joking me? <laughs> Just go use the shortcut. It's fine. Fucking program a proper elevator. It was amazing. Careful. Yeah, careful. No shit. No, I know. I mean, like you're you're seizing up, and you might yank your PS3 off the uh, shelf because Andrew has switched. No, no. Oh, no. Why? Oh, is he gonna get crushed? Is that thing? I don't remember. Jesus. Where's my soul? So uh, Andrew switched to using Wait, a PS4 controller. Um, where'd you die? Right here. Um. So your souls are put in a place prior to where you were when you jumped off. Uh, so they might be on the platform where the, where the item was. God, why? What's the point of living? They don't. They don't. Well, they don't land where you die because if you die by falling in a hole, then you don't have items. Well, that's rude. Congratulations, you found Sean Connery. Hey, it's Blacksmith. Your favorite Ed. character. You can upgrade weapons here. How, what, what does it cost to upgrade a weapon? You can upgrade your crushing battle axe. Uh, it, cro it costs you know, four shards of greystone. I have none. If you, and if you upgrade it, would then gain eight damage. That's not really a lot. No, but you can upgrade like five times. But what about the bastard sword? The bastard sword costs hardstone. You got you have hardstone. I have enough. And you how much does that upgrade it? Five hundred fifty souls. It gets you ten damage. 10 damage. But That's you, a lot nicer. But you need 550 souls. Well, I'm sure I have that much in my body. <laughs> we just gotta write up. <laughs> What's this? this thing? That's a, it's another way of turning it on, I think. Oh, you can get down here without having ever turned this on? There, there's probably another way down. You might be able to just drop down. I don't even actually, I'm not sure. <laughs> like, you like that news? Does that sound happy to you? Where's my fucking there? There's your souls. Just don't fall off. <laughs> Oh, I, well, I can't promise anything, Keith, because this game is about as well made as fucking, <laughs> it could be. You were gained lost souls from a bad game. It was our fault you lost those souls. I do like the idea of playing these in order of release. Ugh. <laughs> okay, you so You learn so many things, so you do not have the souls. I do not have enough souls, no. No. I only have 200. You get souls, or you might have hard souls you can consume, or there might be some down here. Oh, what's that? Uh, what does that message say? Renowned hero soul. Hey, more souls. What does this say? Beware of false messages. There's no <laughs> By the way, there's a cliff. I mean, you're right. So everyone knows there's a cliff right here. But you're also wrong. What is this blood? Caution, cliff. He probably walked off. Or he was idle? Oh. oh, there he goes. Oh, God! <laughs> oh, no, you just watched it. It's like the happening. Yeah, I just watched a dude kill himself. For so you might be able to get enough souls by using an item. Wasn't Renown a fair amount? Uh, I think Renown's 400. Let's find out. Do we want to upgrade the Bastard Sword, though? You can upgrade whatever you want. Yeah, but we're using the axe, and it's a lot better than the Bastard so Sword. So do you prefer the axe? I don't know. The axe is a lot... I mean, the axe is a lot faster. It is nice and fast. And it, it takes require, a lot less stamina. But it does require a greystone, which is another thing you never found before. But you could push forward and see if you find this, since this is a mine. 
Maybe graystone's a thing you'll find here. I found a lot of shards of stuff so far. As of right now, you can't... It, there's no harm in waiting, aside from the part where it can make the future harder. The, the fact that you don't have an upgraded. But uh, you're not going to lose the souls, and you're not going to lose the items, because they're both in your inventory. So they're safe, and, gonna, and they can wait for you to make up your mind for yeah. however long you want to wait. So all I've got left to do... Hi there. Hello. Are you going to show me where to go? <laughs> wait. Why did... Oh, because I fucking died. died. Oh my god. They might not all aggro. It might just be the top one. What's the point? What, can I... Oh. I can throw a knife at him over the barrels. <laughs> Will it reach him? No. The barrel consumed my knife. Come here. <laughs> Come here. The power of barrel consumes you. What are you going to do? <laughs> Well, is he smart enough to swing? What are you gonna do? I actually don't know. What There's is... no way. Uh oh. There's no uh -oh. way. Are they all growing? Whoa, it caught on fire. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh. Wait, is he aggroed or not? I think they're lost. I think they're really confused. If they both charge you, you may not want to stick around. <laughs> Throw a knife? <laughs> I'm talking to you. Okay, they're just not. <laughs> they won't go this way? I wonder if you should just go for the fog door. Oh, oh here it comes. There he goes. That's interesting. These guys have interesting AI. I can say charitably. <laughs> that is the charitable word to describe some of their behavior today. Yeah, look at All you. Right. Backstabbing like a mofo. Watch out. Yeah. Nice um, doesn't come. Pay attention to this guy who apparently is just kind of like... Confused by the whole thing? Oh my god. Yep. Who gave you this sword? Because <laughs> you do not know how to use it properly. I mean, he probably made it. Did he? Oh, no, no, that, no, that's a proper sword, huh? Yeah, that's like a proper sword. Yeah, I thought it wasn't a real sword. No, someone gave that to Maybe this. they're stealing, like, half-crafted uh, swords from Blacksmith Ed. Wow, no wonder he's fucking... Well, he is full of scales. They might be different lengths. I think the swords might be different lengths. Like I they think, just, like I think they theirs just, are broken. Yeah, they I, Or I think this guy has a broken one. I think other. the ends of all these swords are just unfinished. Like they, uh, like they have a hilt and like nothing else. The rest uh, is just like a weird slab that's on fire. Are you, are you weighing whether you want to deal with the salamanders or not? I don't know, yeah. I, whether you want to risk dealing with anything. What happens that. when you deal with the salamanders? Well, you, like, you, you, is go, there, you go look again. Yeah, but is there like something in the room? I believe there was an item in the middle. Okay, but, but the middle's be... on fire. Yeah. No, not the middle. I mean the back of the ra the circular rail. Oh, yeah. There's like a guy back there. There's an item over there. But... Uh, there's a lot of salamanders. There's a lot of salamanders. Well, they have to fall to the ground first. Yeah, there's a lot of salamanders. How much do you trust this scenario? Do you think you can get through this alive? I just need to know what their response is. Here's the question. How much... How big's their hitbox for moving around? Compared to this, like, tiny area that they're going to be on. Well, the, I'm more worried about the fact, like, do they just fall off the wall and hit you in the face? Or do they fall off the wall and, and block both directions you yes. can use to leave? Yeah, like, pretty much. Because, like, I don't want to run past them, and then it's like, da 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 so, I, so if you want to find out what the item is, but you don't want to trap yourself, because you've already noticed the salamanders are here, what if you threw... Uh, knives at two of them and then ran away and they'd follow you out and then while they're gone You could grab oh, the God. item and then they can't trap you Don't scare me like that ghost. You know what I mean? Well, he ran through it and seemed to be okay He ran through it for a few seconds then faded out of existence and He ceased to know what his future is. Is there bloodstains around? Is there what? Is there bloodstain around to inspect? Probably just my own, right? No, uh, no the only bloodstain is the one in the middle <laughs> Green. There are, there are two bloodstains in there so people have died here one well, way or yeah, I well, I can imagine they've died here. Oh boy! I'm just touching the blood stain. Just touching the blood stain. Oh. Okay, that's oh. how it works. That's how it works. Look, you look how he look. He didn't run away. So look what happened to him. Spoilers: He died because he's a blood stain. <laughs> oh God! They all fell down. Yes. Well, that's good news and bad news. You might be able to lure them out, but then you have a lot of small, slow-moving, weird fire objects to avoid that have a very surprisingly abrupt melee attack. Yes. Yes, they do. Is that the only one chasing you? I think it is. Well, it might be time to practice. Fighting him? 
fighting. Or avoiding them. Fighting them. Oh. Because if I learn, then... Because what you I noticed... You need to avoid that fire attack that hurts. Are you going to try blocking it? Oh, touching him hurt you. He knows that. Oh, okay. fuck that guy. Well, he's dead now. Did he so, notice what happened during your first yes, swing? Yes, my first swing. Uh, I have to... I need to wait for them to hit me, because the moment they hit me, they go out. They yeah, don't, he, was, not on he fire. was on fire when he when you hit him, so you hurt yourself. Yeah. And then he ceased to be on fire for a bit, and then he comically flailed into a hole. Yes. <laughs> Which is pretty great. Come here. Come here, you stupid lizard. One of you. There's two of them. Oh, no, I don't want two. That's two. That's one it's too many. definitely two, though. That's one too many lizards. Well, maybe you can just get them out of the way. If the two of them come after you together, then you can run around them, and then their side's open. And you just need to get in and out fast before they slowly get back to you. Like, yeah. Oh, there's Fuck. number three. It's fine. Gotta go faster. Yeah, just don't get trapped. Ah, it's a, some sort of stone. I think it's a scale of dragons, something? Whatever it was, it was a stone. They have the general makings God. of what you see of an upgrade item, so that's good. You found, a, you found an upgrade item. Okay, well, it's called Dragonstone and surrounded by fire monsters, so I wonder what kind of upgrade item it might be. <laughs> Maybe a fire one. <laughs> Maybe. Maybe it involves a charm. Oh, God! <laughs> <laughs> I'm really glad I had my shield up. I, I knew it was going to happen. I knew it. I knew that was it. like a genuine jump scare. Because <laughs> anything could be like could be one shotting you in this game, <laughs> and that's like more terrifying than anything Five Nights at Freddy you could ever hope to accomplish. <laughs> Such a genuine startled moment from you. That's great. To so hit the corner, and there's a thing, yeah. and it struck me immediately. That took me back to playing. Uh, what's it called? The baby game with you. Okay, who's here? Who's here? Just fucking spinning so fast, they can't see me. <laughs> what the fuck are you doing? Oh, Wait, that guy. Is that guy bad? Oh, not you! <laughs> Come on! I'm not even looking at him! <laughs> this fucking game, dude. Do you know how to change targets? Yeah. You just do, do, yeah. Do, do. yeah, well, that doesn't help when my target's not in frame anymore. I'm just making sure that you know how. This fucking guy. Wait, is he not aggressive? He just walked through. Oh, he's aggressive. Is. Wait, did you just like realize that? Uh, <laughs> he just went back, get back to work. To work? At <laughs> chopping wood with a pickaxe. Yeah, what is your job? <laughs> Listen, your job kind of sucks. They might be losing their minds a little bit. They might be hollows. Just stay here with your beloved wood. They're, they're likely suffering from the undead curses, all the other shitty people you see. Oh, over. hey, look an item. What could that be? Ooh, large Heart stone. hardstone. Well, this is a black. And no one cares. Yeah. So that's probably where they got their shitty weapons from. Now where are we? <laughs> that reflex is getting built in now. Ah, ah! Hello there. <laughs> I knew one of you would be here to meet me. Cut off the fucking light. <laughs> no, he survived. Come on. Yeah, but he's all the way back before you got to the salamanders. Yeah, but I wanted him to be dead. Oh, uh, that's a lot. Of uh, that's a lot of explosive battles. Uh, oh, uh, oh. oh no. Do they just react? Oh, there's a guy throwing rocks. <laughs> what the fuck? Are you joking me? Are you seriously throwing rocks? So do you have anything you can do about the explosive barrel pile? Uh, no. You don't have a single firebomb? I don't have a fair burn. Oh. But I could roll through it. You could try, and if you're fast enough, no one could blow it up in time. But you gotta really go fast. Maybe roll through it, then run up, roll uphill? Is there a guy to blow it up? I don't know, but it's obviously it looks like a trap, right? <laughs> Oh god, the physics. Well, now they're gone. <laughs> Your trap is eluded. If, if that was someone's trap, it's gone now. Okay, well, there's as long lot, as... There's, there's a lot of paths here, by the way. These guys aren't... Okay, they're not chasing... They're not Jesus, they're not, what a... <laughs> you see how many... What a terrifying... You see how many flame swords there are? That's, oh, that's a message to say. Run straight through. Oh, you gotta run? Ooh, that's why they said run. A new soldier, soldier soul. soul. Oh, I a great club. I bet you that's a strength weapon. Uh, wasn't your last message. club? Wasn't your last? Got club a good though? item. Thanks. Uh, look at your club. What, did, yeah. Was a great club your first weapon, or was that just a normal club? How do I get back? Uh, let's look at your club and just yeah. focus on the happy part. Let's not. Because you may have lost some progress. <laughs> well, at least I don't die. Though. Was your original weapon a great club or just a club? Uh, I think it was. Yeah, that that's a that wasn't my original weapon. The spike whip. The yeah. Spike club. Let, oh, a. 
A. But what's that? My, that physical attack minus sixty one. Oh, your st your strength's not high enough for it. What? You need twenty strength. What is my strength now? Not twenty, apparently. Wow. Uh, click on your man icon on the right. I'm trying to. There we go. Sixteen. Uh, eighteen. Yep. You, you only need two points. Fucking god damn it. Well, look look how good that club is. The club is so good. Yeah. Look, no. Look how good look how good it's gonna be. So right now... Plus 60, is that the plus 61? So here's the thing, right now... First of all, it has A scaling with strength. You've never seen that before. No. Uh, it has 100 base damage on its own. Period. Wow. And right now it has negative 61 scaling on damage because you don't, you can't wield it. But event, the afterwards, that'll be... In, uh, once, you get, once you get 20 uh, strength, that'll be a positive number. It won't necessarily... I don't know if it'll be 61 necessarily, right off the bat, but it it'll, be, be. it'll be a positive number, and the, that, and what'll happen is every time you upgrade that, every every time you upgrade the weapon, the number on the left will go higher, and every time you upgrade your strength, the number on the right will go higher. Oh, my God. Yeah. That might be my favorite weapon. Can you wield it? Yeah, you, you probably can't even wield it to see what its animation is You aren't is strong like. enough to use this with one. Oh, oh you could, you could two-hand it. That's a good point, but you'd have to be shieldless. Well, no, you don't have to unequip your shield, you just press oh, triangle. Oh my god. That's not how that works. So put your shield back on. Uh... There you go. Yeah. So oh, just... So you, you oh, when you're, well, you just hit triangle to end it, see? Whoa. So look at the weapons icon, and then hit triangle. When you, yeah, it says like... Yeah, ability, ability shortage. shortage. So now you can use it. Let's see what you're... T oh that's my god. That's slow as fuck. It is slow as fuck. Is that the heavy attack? Yeah, that's the slow attack. Yeah, that is but the damage. Yeah, yeah, but it probably hurts people. Probably staggers. This people. is exactly what I was hoping. Let's though. look at your your attack value. Look at your uh, character's screen, the character sheet. You should have an attack value somewhere. Uh, one hundred and sixty is your right hand one uh, weapon damage right now. Uh, look at look at your uh, check out your uh, what does it say if the weapon scaling when you're two handing? It doesn't even. I don't know if the equipment screen will look at that. But yeah, it's a, but yeah, you currently have 160. Let's see. Nah, it's, no, plus 60. Plus 60. And it'll go up as you increase your strength, which you probably want to do because Whoa. the option of the option of one-handing it's probably a good idea to get. Yeah, but, but for now you can you can for now you can at least two-hand it. Wait, for now, how do we get the fuck out of here? Well, there's only one direction. No, if I drop, I'll die. Only one way to know. Wait. What are you looking at? Oh, I can't drop onto those. No. You could go for the lip. That might help. Yeah, see? You're fine. Uh, Fall damage is really not that bad in this game. It gets way worse later. <laughs> say that as I just it got get, done dying from fall damage. That was a long fall. That was the entire length of an elevator shaft. That's true. That was actually not a bad this was, fall. This was a two-step fall. That was minor. Alright, so you know how to get back where you are, though. Yeah. Because you're in a previous area. But hey, you got a big badass super club. Oh, the salamander spikes. Right there. Yeah. You might be guarding something. Whenever there's a salamander on the wall, they're usually guarding treasure that has an ambush. Oh, <laughs> the guy you knocked out earlier! Oh no! Oh, 172! Oh, no. <laughs> so much damage! <laughs> that guy was not ready. No, he wasn't. Oh. He should have been, because you already fought him. Well, he was on his way back. He was doing so a walk of shame. So now the problem is you have to really compensate for how shit your attack speed is. So you gotta be real careful when you choose to attack. Yeah, but I could like ace anybody. And constantly keep in mind how to switch to your shield if you need to block. Because you need to hit triangle then L1. Yeah. And then you have to press triangle again to attack. Because if, if you try attacking right now and see how embarrassing it is. Because <laughs> it's not a good time. See that? Oh, that is... You so usually if you attack with a weapon you can't use it properly, first of all, the attack number sucks, but also like... You're just kind of like, yeah. You're like, oh, how do I pick this weapon back up? It's too heavy. Salamanders. More salamanders. A lot of salamanders. A lot of sals around here. Let's see, what is that? Looks what like, is that? Looks like souls. Or more grass. Moon. I could always use more... Who doesn't like grass? I could always use more grass. Oh, and here's the oh. thing. I wonder how I wonder how many upgrading materials you have for this club. Oh, <laughs> to make it even better already. So there's oh. two items there, and where are you compared to the enemies? 
Well, they don't know I'm here. And one of them has a pickaxe, which seems very useless when you have an armada of sword wielders. Yes. Yeah. So they may be avoidable. They may be 100%. Because you've gone around them now. And I think that the communication they're trying to give you when they give you a giant mob like that is to be like, find a way to not go this way. Because <laughs> this is a nightmare. <laughs> like a bridge. Oh, noisy. Oh, fuck. <laughs> fuck you, I got a super sword. Steel shield. Steel shield. You got a new shield. Okay, well, don't attack Are you going to risk it right now? Yeah, don't attack <laughs> You also have a spike shield. Man, when did I get the spike shield? I don't remember. It's kind of butts, though. Uh, it has 100% damage reduction. But it's an E. Yeah, but that's for that's for scaling on attack. How often do you hit people with your shield, necessarily? Not a lot. Meanwhile, Whoa! Ooh, look at that guard break reduction. Whoa! So guard break reduction affects how much stamina you lose when you block. Oh my god! This so the better that number is, right now. the better that number is, the better you go. It might be worth looking at the spike shield. It probably has a special effect if you look at the stat screen. I mean, it's explanation screen. Oh. Uh, it see. also meant to be used for attacking and can be used to pierce the enemy. Yeah, so that one actually probably had. So I bet probably, you. I it bet probably you, does damage. I bet the you... parry animation actually hurts people with that weapon. That's kind of cool. Because it's spiked. I don't care, but that's yeah, cool. Yeah, but it's fun. This, though. Whoa, Whoa what? Wait. Hold so on. So that's the thing. You've upgraded to a great shield. You Whoa. Can't, so now you can't parry. You can block, but you can't parry. I can chip somebody on the feet. Yeah, you can, like, chump, shove someone with it. Uh, you, do have, you do have Holy the strength for it, right? I assume you do. I, uh, yeah, it was all positive. Yeah. I just didn't check the number. Yeah, you have the exact requirement. Yes. So you can use this, and yeah, just just don't try to parry anyone because you can now. Amazing! Look at this thing. Yeah, this thing's huge. You got yourself an all new weapon and shield, but you're still in a skirt. Look, you know what? Still running around in boy shorts. It takes time <laughs> to get this good. You're getting a lot of progress today. I am getting a lot you of. You got progress like no today. progress last week. Yeah, I got nowhere <laughs> at all. But I got everywhere today. Oh, that's a lot of salamanders. That's a lot of salamanders. Use spells on the next enemy. Oh. <laughs> well, I guess I won't. Oh, wait. Is there nowhere else I can go? Oh, no. I may have made a mistake. Do you want a little bit of heartache save salvation? Sure. Uh, sure. I think they just hinted you at what might happen, actually. Yeah. So there's dogs in the area. And it's up to you how much you want to trust the club right now versus a shield and axe Why for a bit. Why are there dogs in the area? It might not be a terrible idea to do shield and axe for a little bit. Yeah, I'm just going to go back to... At least until you can one-hand the club when, when you need to. Yeah. But that, that was a tease of what you're going to be really happy about soon, I think. Is that, uh, that, sh that club and shield combo. Uh, let's see. I'm going to go ahead and do this. All right. What are you gonna do? You're fighting salamanders. I see. Look at this, look at this Xiao Yun motherfucker. Oh. Well, you didn't do good to them salamanders. I see. I see. Huh. <laughs> this place is so menacing. This specific room. You're like you know something's gonna go wrong. Yeah. But we've we established before that you don't know what the exact trigger location is gonna be for a salamander room. Yeah. <laughs> uh, Oh god, there's one right there! One right there. Okay. Oh, there's an item over there. Oh what? god damn fucking uh, wolves! That's the wolf. Oh. Fucking scared the shit yeah, out of me! You're at half health. So there's Jesus. an item there, but there's also clearly a salamander there. God, let me catch my breath. <laughs> fucking goddamn. Fucking dogs. Now there's more. Two more dogs. How did that feel? <laughs> as, he, as he clanks directly yeah. into your giant shield. Do you see the stamina you didn't lose, basically? I didn't lose stamina or health. You got a tiny chip of stamina, period, from blocking Ed's it. Ed's grindstone? Ed's grindstone. Well, Ed, I found your grindstone. This is an important time to remind you, periodically. Items have durability. Okay. Oh, that's what you're being chased by a flame salamander. Bad time to stop. <laughs> Just have to remind you, because you played a tiny bit of, of Dark Souls 2. Like, you didn't even beat one boss, but you played a little bit. Uh, and you'll remember that there was like a little meter for each item, and then the durability would respawn at every bonfire. Yeah. The, oh, is the grindstone to keep the durability up? So what happens is at Demon Souls and Bloodborne, you have normal item durability, like in all RPGs, which is that it just goes down over time until you do something about it. 
But while Dark Souls uh, in Dark Souls 2, your durability would go down quickly. It goes slower, but you gotta you gotta check periodically, or your weapon's gonna start breaking. Ow! What the oh, fuck? No. Wait, what? You're aggroed on me? I was watching the blood stain. Oh no! I was under the assumption that fucking everything was cool. Oh, no. Okay, well if everything's not cool, you can <laughs> fuck you right can off. Fuck right off. What? What a weird sound effect for blocking. Dong. It sounds like the Krillin Escar sound, right? The break. Yeah. Wait. Wait, is that what it is? The the breaking pot stock sound on an echo. Yeah. Whoa. That's the worst sound to use for blocking. <laughs> Ow! Oh, I did not have stamina. Oops! Pressed it one too many times. I wonder if anyone ever knows what I'm talking about when I call it the Krillin Escar. <laughs> I mean, somebody Do has. Do you know to. what I'm talking about? Do you remember that anymore? Uh, I think we talked about it during the Sonic thing, but I forgot. Oh, right, because they used to talk down there, too. You're very dying, by the way. Just, I'm just, just very general dying. warning. <laughs> you are very dying. Good I'm, I'm I did a good very sentence. dying. You're all going to very die down here. So, in the Plinket reviews of the Star Trek movies, they're making fun of how the movies don't understand the show. Yeah. And there's a whole episode dedicated to Picard getting this amazing relic from that one, like, love interest girl and everything, and it's like, or, what, or maybe, maybe it wasn't her, but it was some great honor that he got this relic uh, given to him. Okay. And in the Star Trek movie, he just, like, picks it up and throws it to the side at one point while they're scavenging through, like, the, the ruined, uh, through the ruined, uh, Enterprise, and, like, he should be so emotional about finding that thing, and he's like, eh, some prop, throw it over there. And then, so, like, in the Plinket review, they played the shattering pot noise over that, <laughs> over that scene. And juxtaposed it with the scene of him getting it and being so honored in the actual show. <laughs> oh, well, he won't be bothering you for a bit. Yep, no you, more progress for you. I'm going to make a shortcut. Aren't the shortcuts exciting in this game? Uh, they're relieving. Yeah. <laughs> it's like, oh, good, less things to do. Wait. Now it's watery? The water was powering something, and oh. now something's not being powered. Uh-oh, it's not being powered. Oh my god! And the water's the being redirected. fucking fire on the ground is gone. That's crazy. The, the fire on the ground that's only three flaming sword guys away from your shortcut from the spawn point. So like, the, you're, you're, despite the going deeper and deeper, your walk's getting continually shorter into this level. Uh, not today, Buckaroonie. You did it. Okay. Um, you fucked him up. I fucked him up. Only 53 more souls, and you can upgrade your your uh, well. That could, was the other item. I could but, upgrade the bastard but it might, sword. But it might be an applicable. Which is worthless now. But it now. might be an applicable number. Do you want to investigate that one salamander? What salamander? The, the one, one over here, a salamander. I could. If he's propped over a wall somewhere, it's it goes to the reason that he might be guarding something, which means he, there might oh, be something. Oh, I can go down wall. here. This is, where, this is where he came from in the first place. Well, yeah, but I didn't realize yeah. that I could go this way. I thought this black part so was might a pit. Be an, yeah, there's an item. There it goes. <laughs> Are you so okay? This, so this was your first spot to encounter one of these guys. Ah. Oh. But instead, <laughs> you got a whole room full of them. What are you going to mail? Oh. I don't know if I ever fight these guys, honestly. <laughs> I think I just am like, ugh, go away. Shard, Shard of, of Meltstone. Melt That's different from Dragonstone. Sounds like a victim of Dragonstone. Alright, well, let's go. Did your body break a box? Yeah. What a sad life. This body just does damage to everything around it. Um, scary. Alright, so let's keep going then. So we got everything from... Uh, I got the item in that room. Salamander's still there, though. Look at that water. Uh, <gasps> there's a Progress. lot of items. items. A Does lot the floor hurt at all? No. What was that? You press it. You press it so fast. Oh, half moon <gasps> grass. Four half moon grass. Good. That's a lot of half moon grass. Oh, there's my dead salamander friend. Yep, he's still here because you still haven't died. This ring, ring of, of poison, poison resistance. resistance. <gasps> Fuck that. I don't fucking need that. <laughs> I need fire resistance that right now. That false excitement was great. I just, I, well, what am I, I'm not getting poisoned <laughs> by anything. <laughs> Hi. Fucking god damn it. What's the point? Yeah, 281 positive. Why did you, you, you came all the way back here. This is here what happens when you let the people crowdsource feedback. Is that that bullshit happens? And everyone votes it up. 
Do you wear a fire, fire head? See, no joke. There's a fucking room. room full of barrels. Uh, 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 and yeah. a fire guy. Come on, come on. I want to wait for part two. <laughs> uh, you want to try that again? But this time it hit me, actually. He might hit you. Be careful. Oh, there you go. You want to try this a third time, but there's actually hit me. Fewer this of time. them now. Oh god, there's still so many barrels left in the room. Yeah, there's a lot of barrels left in this room. Wow. Oh, oh, that was a close one. Oh, oh. Okay, you know what? Did you ever get? Yeah, that's that's an option too. You ever get better at fighting these guys? Yeah. Just two hand the weapon. Think you can take them pretty easily. Oh yeah, because you never use your shield with these guys, huh? Yeah. Is it because you can't tell that you can't see their attacks very well? Uh, I think it's because I can't block the fire. So what's the point? Oh, and you can't like see the wind up of which ones. Which. Okay, so every barrel's gone now. It's a better world we live in. You might be able to backstab him because he's not in the doorway. Maybe. Oh, block that! Oh no! Yeah. Oh no! If I stand, oh, oh, if I stand oh, here. Oh, oh, oh. Perfect. Oh, I thought he was gonna hit you through the nah. like through the needle. Oh my god! It's exciting. What are you gonna do? 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 You gonna hit me? Well, can you backstab him? Oh, <laughs> I love the shoves. <laughs> do you do that on purpose? No. <laughs> You do it on accident too? Yeah. It's always on accident when I do it. I forget I practically forget it's in the game. Oh no. No, that's oh. not the button. Watch out. I really don't like these fat guys. They take some practice. It's because I don't have a ranged weapon. Yeah. If I had something I can also hit them with at a range, it would be less bothersome. You can fight them in melee, it's just you need to learn to use their their animations against them. Yeah. For example, like when they do the fireball, you could roll the side, and, and that takes less recovery than trying to block it. Oh, what do you got? Full moon grass. Thank you. It's even better grass. You owe me. Yeah, he owes you about I, a full moon I, of grass after you use those two half moons. Yeah. <laughs> what does it say? It's safe here. It's true. <laughs> yeah, the bunk beds are safe. Thanks. Because it no, it blocks the fireball. I know. Yeah. I'm just saying, like, thanks for that message. There are a lot of safe zone messages throughout the campaign. Just in ir irrevocably from audience members. Stone of Ethereal Eyes. You got another one! Nice. You got more humanity. More humanity. So if you humanity. desperately want your health bar all the way back for one life, now you have it. Eh, at this you point... Two of those. At this point, I've... I've <laughs> it's kind of the Bane situation. Yeah. Like... So a common approach is to be all like, I have I put a few attempts on a boss, and I think I can get it this time, but just an extra more, bit, bit, bit of health would turn the tables for me. Yeah. Is often the reason people do that. What? Or if you want to summon someone, but I don't think they're going to find people. Wait, how did you... He just you... fell down from somewhere. Watch out. From up there. Well, I, I think I already avoided the... Yeah, I think he fell down. It's like, oh... Are you alright there, dude? Dang it. He's like walking back. Yeah, there's like a there's like a throw rocks thing here, isn't there? And he just fell down, so he can't throw rocks anymore. Oh, well, dang it. You tried, girl. So I don't know if you noticed yet, but uh, the phantoms used to look almost uh, usually look almost always the same. As a general rule, uh, in most of these games, they don't actually accurately represent your character in phantom form. Okay. As the silhouettes, they usually just have like three stock characters. Uh, they just have, it's yeah. In Dark Souls 2, I think it was really obvious because I think that there was literally like a warrior, a thief, and a mage were basically the three characters you would see for the entire campaign. Mm. And people would be automatically turned into one of those for their like white silhouettes and blood God prints and stuff. Damn it! Hi! <laughs> Fucking. Oh. What are you saying? Oh, about? It's a lot of webbing. Oh, yeah, there's like a bunch of hung up guys back there, so I'm waiting for spiders. You're waiting for Shelob? Yeah. Is that our boss? Is that today's boss? Uh, yeah, that's today's boss. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yes. As you look up and all you see is just Yeah, alright. Uh, show me how this went for you. <laughs> how did he die? Uh. Well, uh, good to know. 
Uh, I think he moved the elevator and then jumped in the hole. Yeah. <laughs> Without looking, the elevator. It's looking like that. <laughs> was, uh, Tell me how you died. Uh, he might just descend through the floor on his elevator. <laughs> There's so much web here. Where is he? Oh, did you click on it? Yeah. Where'd it takes go? them a moment to spawn. He might he might have spawned going downhill. I mean, down the elevator. <laughs> he just falls out of the sky. <laughs> like, what? Like he, well, I mean, like, he might have spawned going down the elevator so you can't see him because he's under the elevator by the time he appears. Oh. Because uh, bloodstains, I think, spawn in generally the same location where your uh, souls would spawn if you died.